Rumors of the Duchess of Sussex's difficult nature have been swirling for weeks, and now royal insiders have suggested that tensions behind the palace doors may be down to a culture clash. A source told People magazine that while Meghan is forthright about her visions for the future veteran royal aides might not be used to her say it as you see it American mentality. The most difficult job in the royal family is to work with Meghan's ambitions and make them realizable, added a source close to the family. She will get frustrated if she is told, you can't do this or can't do that. Meghan's forthright nature may also explain tensions with her sister-in-law Kate who is known for her more typical British reserve, with insiders having described the pair as very different people. Before joining the royal family, Meghan had a career as an actress and a platform for the issues she cared about, such as feminism, politics and human rights. Since marrying Prince Harry she's had to shut down her social media accounts and fall into line with strict rules on royals not making political statements. Meanwhile, future Queen Kate has had years to get used to maintaining a dignified and uncontroversial silence. Earlier this week, royal biographer Joseph said that Meghan has faced more of a public backlash than her sister-in-law as she's trying to bring the monarchy into the 21st century. Speaking on the Victoria Derbyshire show, Claudia said, the reality is that Kate is a very different person. She's very quiet, she's not trying to change the royal family, she's not trying to do anything differently, she's like William. She doesn't like the publicity, she doesn't like to be in the public eye. She has been in the press, there have been lots of stories about her over time. Not so quickly perhaps, but she's not breaking the rules in the same way as Meghan. Dot meanwhile, there have been reports that Prince Harry, 34, and Meghan have not endeared themselves to royal household staff with their somewhat dictatorial behavior. The Mail reported that Meghan had wanted air fresheners for the musty odor of St. George's Chapel, Windsor Castle. Recently the Sunday Mirror claimed that Meghan's personal assistant Melissa Tabati resigned after just six months, having broken down in tears over the stress of her job. The Duchess of Cambridge was also reportedly left in tears after a bridesmaid's dress fitting for Princess Charlotte ahead of Harry and Meghan's wedding in May. Dot, 